Okay, sir, what, what, what's your name? Hello, I'm Harold Gottbox from the Buffalo Billionaires, and I'm here because you people deserve to know the truth, and you ain't gonna get it from these tree huggers and echo Nazis. For starters, this Pope is a commie. He just wants to destroy capitalism, destroy our way of life, destroy our jobs, so that we're all poor. Because, you know, Jesus loved poor people, so let's make a whole bunch more of them. He needs to stick to his day job and stop interfering in politics. And this global warming, climate change stuff is all bunk. It's a hoax. Per perpetrated, oh, I gotta work on it. Perpetrated by pointy headed scientists fudging the data for their tree hugging radical buddies. Don't you remember all that snow and cold we had last year? Now tell me about global warming. We could have used some of that last year. And even if global warming was real, it would be a jobs creator. Already we've got a lot of new jobs as forest fire fires. We're gonna need people to build dikes around Miami and New York City. Not to mention rebuilding all this stuff that gets blown down, washed away, or burned up. It's a great opportunity to make money. And it's going to create jobs. Now, how many of you are ready to give up your pickup trucks and SUVs and go ride bicycles? Yeah, I thought not. So don't listen to this nonsense. Everything is fine just the way it is now. Okay. Uh, now, now, why why don't you think should, shouldn't shouldn't uh, the tax shouldn't the rich be taxed more so that we have more money to support the social programs? So it's just ah! You're killing me here. Are you kidding? No, 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 no. Everybody should be taxed so as to give us more money to to do other things that we do, which is create jobs. So give us more money and we'll create more jobs. Now, only uh, 200 families uh, give about 80% of the uh, money for the presidential election. Are you one of those 200 families that will uh, elect, uh, the, try to elect a, a Republican uh, the next, next year? Well, you know, I mean, I try not to get involved with telling people what money goes where and who provides it, but obviously we'd be pleased if a Republican is um, is elected, but, you know, we've worked with the Democrats before, you know, um, money talks, basically, regardless, so. But, but, but don't you own a candidate? I mean, you, you're probably the only billionaire who doesn't own a candidate. You, you sound like a very liberal billionaire. Well, first of all, you, that's a misconception. Uh, we don't own, we rent. Oh, you, oh I'm sorry. Uh, it's fairly uh, I'm sorry. contingent, you know? Okay. So, uh, you know, we've got our hands right. in a lot of pies and, you know, yada, 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 whatever. Okay. Uh, do, you, do you think slavery should be brought back or is it here already? Well, the beautiful thing is what we have now is, is wage slavery, but nobody is allowed to say that because nobody understands the concept. But yeah. it's kind of like the same thing, only the beauty of it is the slave owners don't have to feed and clothe the slaves anymore. Right. They just send them home to their uh, cardboard box yeah. over the bridge or whatever. Right, right, right. Well, do you have any final thoughts for the audience? Uh, I mean, uh, you know, how's the stock market is going down the tube now, so, what, you know, you must have lost uh, hundreds of millions of dollars in the last three days. Oh, uh, well, uh, you know, whenever we lose a little here, we make it up there, you know. Uh, and as much as I'd like you to worry about us, you'll, uh, you'll, we'll be fine. You, you, you can fire more people so your profits are protected, though, right? Yeah, yeah, and move so, stuff over. Yeah, right. And so you won't have to pay U.S. taxes if you get more profits over there. There. Yeah, well, thank you very much for your time here. It was my pleasure. Thank and, uh, you much. And, uh, you're a uh, wonderful person, and uh, you should well, really the meet the you should really meet the Pope someday. So. Oh, I'd love to. I give him a piece of my mind. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what are you selling? <laughs>